Well, that did not work. His psychological came back fine, except the doctor stated that he is depressed from not being an involved father. Well, Steve, that is just too bad, isn't it? He is just a sperm donor. The kids have a babysitter, public schools, a stepfather, and they hang out at the airport. He does have family from Chicago and New York here now, and they want to see the children often. The children are seeing a child psychiatrist, Dr. Clark, and he has put all three children on dexedrine, an amphetamine. He diagnosed them all with attention deficit disorder. The father states in his motion that the kids suffer from not having an involved father in their lives and not ADHD. He wants a second opinion. How old are these rugrats? How the hell do I know, Steve? I never met them. They are small and young. My client prefers that the family does not see the child and very often. He claims in his motion that they are a very close Italian family and these children are deprived from loving family. He also wants to enroll them in martial arts and baseball. He is dangerous. Really? What has he done? Has he ever been arrested? No, Steve, but who cares? I am just practicing for the hearing with more lies and exaggerations about the father. I want my legal fees. The kids can wander on the Las Vegas Strip. I don't care. By the way, why did you have your pregnant wife sent to jail? More domestic violence? What happened? She is about 130 pounds and you are about 300 pounds and almost 7 feet tall. Who won the fight? Okay, Rhonda, never mind. I will rule in your favor as usual. The father can pound sand. I will drag out the case for years and do nothing for him or the kids. Now listen. Next time he appears in court, I want my money. Throw his ass in jail. The mother and stepfather like it. However, they do want their extortion and kidnapping money. I mean child support. Okay, Rhonda. I'll see you at the hearing and at the party Saturday. Bye.